morning guys it is the 8th of January it is about 7 o'clock I just got back from my first personal training session of 2018 and let me tell you the struggle is real I was physically Gonna get ready for work Monday. I have a case of the Monday blues just because yesterday was such a good day. Um, but yeah, it's pretty gloomy today, but it's still hot in Sydney. Um, but yeah, gonna get ready for work. Hope you guys have a great Monday. Okay, guys, so just had a little rest much needed rest, it was like 10 minutes. But I just wanted to show you guys what I'm making for breakfast, just really quickly. We've got some onion chopped up. I've got some kale, so this homegrown kale and mushrooms. And then I'm just going to make a quick omelet. Oh, there's also some garlic. And yeah, I'm just going to fry it up and have that for breakfast. I'm also going to do a um, simple tuna salad for lunch and then my smoothie for kind of like a midday on the way home from work kind of like a snack that I do so I'll show you guys that as well Okay, so these are the contents of my smoothie. <clears throat> we first have um, some 100% whey. This is chocolate. Um, very simple, it tastes good with anything, so that's why I get chocolate. We have some um, Costco or Kirkland um, blueberries, they are frozen. We have flaxseed, one banana. I also add in um, l glutamine after a workout just to help with um, muscle recovery and things like that. Chia seeds, so we have frozen spinach here, um, Greek yogurt and some unsweetened coconut milk. I'm going to blend it all in this Vitamix. This Vitamix gets used every single day, multiple times a day. So it's been really good to us. Um, but yeah, so this is everything that goes into my daily smoothie. I have this every single day. Um, on the way home from work. Over here I've just added the kale and the mushrooms. I'm just gonna let the kale wilt up a little bit, let the mushrooms brown, add some salt and pepper, and then I'm gonna add my two eggs. Anyways, I'm gonna start with my smoothie and I'll show you guys how I go in a sec. Over here the omelet is looking yummy. I've already added my two eggs. I'm just going to add some salt, pepper and we're done. I um, don't think I'll have time to show you guys my tuna salad just because I'm in a rush. I'm going to do it extremely quickly and then um, yeah we're good to go. Thanks for joining me this morning guys and I hope you're having a fantastic Monday morning. I'm going to stock up on some tuna. Uh, let's see you go ham. <laughs> oh my god, that chicken smells so good. Just doing some grocery shopping. We have some 
pretty healthy stuff in here. everyone finally I've just had the probably one of the most stressful weeks it is the 12th of January and I am so happy to um, say that it is Friday today so last day of work and then after work I have an appointment with my um, eyelash extension lady finally I have been wanting to go get my eyelashes done again a really really long time but just haven't had the chance to so I'm going to do that today and I'm so excited and I'll probably take you guys along as well um, but yeah as I've already mentioned before um, nothing very exciting during the week but we do have a poker game tomorrow night so my brother is hosting um, one of his poker games that we have every so often and it gets um, a little bit crazy, it depends. I hope it will be a good night though, there's gonna be a few of us. So I will show you guys that as well. And then on Sunday, I'm not too sure what's happening. Hopefully we'll be um, getting ready for um, Monday as in meal prepping and things like that. But yeah, happy Friday once again and I will see you guys in a little bit. Whoa, you guys, I did not realize how hot it was going to be. That's what happens when you friggin' sit in an office all day. But it is like 38 degrees, what the hell? And it was so cold the past few days. But anyways, so um, TGIF, it was such an unproductive day today. When it hit like 12 o'clock, I was just like, oh, I wanna go home. I have my eyelash extension um, appointment in about an hour, so I'm gonna go home. I need to go to the ATM, get out some cash, and then yeah, I'm gonna go and get my eyelashes done. I'm so excited. Um, it's been so long. I've been just kind of letting my eyelashes grow and strengthen them a little bit strengthen themselves back up um but yeah so we're gonna do i'm gonna do that and then um Suraj is cooking today so he's gonna make some steaks for us and then we're just gonna chill probably watch a movie and that's our friday night so i hope you guys have a great friday night as well and yes. Hello guys, I just got my lashes done. Yo. Ah, that's interesting. So yeah, so I ended up getting um, 12 inches, 12 and then 11 on the inside, just because the last time we did it, I think I did, 13 and 12 and then I went outside put my glasses back on and it just like clashed with my glasses which is kind of stupid but yeah it's much better now but yeah I'm so excited I have my lashes back but yeah I thought it was like a light show or something, but it's just lightning. But it's not raining and there's no thunder. 
Oh my god. So I'm just home in front of my house and look at this lightning. It is crazy. I've never seen anything like it. Today it is Saturday as I mentioned before I think um, so my grandpa is in hospital so I've actually been in there with him for about two hours got home um, and then I've just been editing I really want to try and get this new video up um, as soon as possible no later than Monday and you know next thing I know it's like four o'clock and poker is gonna start soon I just went and picked up Siraj to come to my house and yeah we're just waiting for everyone else to come and while I do that I'm going to edit so yeah and um, this is the look that I did today and this is what I'm editing um, as well. so yeah not very exciting day so far <laughs> but hopefully um, tonight will be a lot better but yeah Mwah. Hope you guys are having a great Saturday.
such a long ago and it was a really good um, game actually. So there was one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, eight of us I think. Um, I broke even and then I won an extra ten dollars. Um, and I mean everyone did pretty well and there was some intense hands but it's really good. Really, really really fun. We haven't played poker in a really long time so um, so yeah it was great. Um, but yeah tomorrow same routine I'm just gonna go to Sriracha's we're gonna have breakfast together and then we're going to um, prep some meals for the week. But yeah I hope you guys had a really great Saturday um, and a great um, weekend overall. Oh my god, it is just hella windy today. Whew. So I'm just going to head to the deli and grab some bacon. And then also, um, yeah, just bacon. And then go to Sriracha's house so we can have some breakfast. Yay! You guys, check out how windy it is. It's crazy out there. It's only 21 degrees as well, so it's freezing. Well, it's freezing for us. to make some breakfast. You want coffee, babe? No, we're going later, are we? Yeah, so? Uh, make some coffee. And so we're gonna have some eggs, uh, bacon, mushroom, tomato, maybe a bit of toast. And yeah. And then we have to go to Harvey Norman to pick up the fridge which we're excited about because he's fine what is that he's finally gonna have freaking ice in his fridge who doesn't have ice in their fridge right? I'm not privileged for having ice in my fridge um, but yeah and then we're gonna go grocery shopping for our lunches this week Exciting thing ever. Hey! What's wrong? Don't look at me. But I thought you like pictures. Uh, and you say cheese. <laughs> so we have been having a non-productive day up until about one o'clock um, we went to pick up the fridge and then we went grocery shopping and it's already four o'clock but we've been watching this new show on Netflix called um, somebody feed Phil and Phil Rosenthal is the creator of everybody loves Raymond and he goes around to countries eating food so we watched the one in Bangkok and we watched the one in Saigon and it was really really good so anyone who loves food and travel definitely check it out it's a Netflix original documentary series so yeah and now we're just going to um, 
meal prep. We just got some charcoal chicken and we're just gonna make some salads and my battery is running out. So I will check back with you guys later.